you are. Oh, you are Lord. You are. Oh, you are Lord. You are. Yes, you are. Yeah. Hey, you are Lord. You are. Come on, shut the leg. You are Lord. You are Lord. Yes, you are. Oh, I will worship you. I will worship you. Lift you high. Lift you high above the earth and the heaven. I will worship you. I will lift you high. Lift you high. And the heavens, oh, you are Lord. Hey, you, you are Lord. Yes, you are. Yeah. Yes, you are. A blessed morning to you, dear starter. We are excited to come your way again. It's another blessed morning. Blessed. And we pray that as you join us, may your day have a good effect Amen. as a result of your prayer. Amen. In the name of Jesus. Amen. Hallelujah. Amen. Call a friend, share the link on Amen. all platforms and groups, and tell them we have just 30 minutes Amen. and they should join in. Their lives will never be the same again. Hallelujah. Amen. We are taking our scripture for consideration again from Psalm 23, verse number 5. We did the same yesterday. Psalm 23, verse number 5, where it says, Thou prepared a table before me in the presence of my enemies. Thou anoints my head with oil, my cup runneth over. Hallelujah. Amen. Hallelujah. Amen. I pray that you shall have a new testimony every day. Amen. May you have more miracles than you can carry. Amen. May you have more testimonies that you can carry. Amen. In the mighty name of... Yes. Come on, give the Lord a mighty hand here. <laughs> Hallelujah. Amen. Oh my goodness. So, my so yesterday we dealt with the fact that it was strange for God to set a table before us in the presence of our enemies. We liken the table that God is setting to be your promotion. Yeah. To be your marriage, yeah. to be your honor, yes. to be your graduation, yes. to be a breakthrough, yes. to be a testimony. Yes. And we are saying that when God is doing this or these things are coming, they are times of celebration and jubilation. And everybody would love to have these times of jubilation in the presence of their loved ones yes. and the presence of their helpers. Yes. Those who help them to get where they are. Those are the people who must be present. Yeah. But God is doing something different. He is setting the table in the presence of the enemies. And we are asking a question, where are the helpers? Yeah. Or where are those who helped us? Or where are the lovers? Yeah. Ladies and gentlemen, today I will try to attempt to answer with one answer. And then we will go on to pray with it. It suggests that the helpers were not available. How can somebody watch you through school and during your graduation, the person is not there? How can somebody cater for you and through your life and support you and stand with you? And when you have become somebody, you cannot see that person anywhere in your life. And now what you have been elevated to another level, there are only strangers and enemies around you. Where are the helpers? Those who prayed for you, those who honored you, where are they? That now that you have seen the miracle you were laboring for many years, they are not there to be found. Today, I want to suggest you that three things could have taken them away from you. Number one, manipulations and contentions. Some of our helpers and our loved ones, because of contentions, their family and their relationship have been broken. And even though they labored for us, today they are nowhere to be found. Ah. When the Lord has blessed us for them to come and enjoy some because of a certain little fight and contention. You know what I'm talking about is real. They are nowhere to be found in our lives. In the presence of my enemies, we are surrounded by enemies in the day that we should be rejoicing the most. My goodness. I like 
the way you acquire TV on the internet. I like the way. Send me five emojis. Send me five emojis. They labored. Why is the mother who sold her cloth? Why is the father who will not sleep? Work three jobs, four jobs. Now that we are graduating, that father is not there. Why? Because there is contentions and manipulations. We'll be dealing with it. Number two. Ailments and sicknesses. Hey. Oh, Jesus. Oh, Jesus. Some of them were there for us. But when it was not time for us to be elevated, sickness has caused them not to be able to come. And you are, you are being celebrated, but you are sad in your heart because the people who stood with you, sickness has kept them in their rooms. Today we are praying for them. We are praying for them. Last but not the least, premature death. The mother... And the father who took care of you mm. and prayed in all earnest that you become a great person. Mm. Today you are marrying. Mm. And it's now somebody you don't know who is now walking you down the aisle. Mm. Your father who should have walked you down the aisle. Mm. Death came too early. My God. Oh, Jesus. <laughs> Death came too early. And now you are being honored. The table is prepared. So the lovers and the helpers, mm. we cannot find them. Cannot but today, we are praying that may the Lord keep them and preserve them. When it is time for us to be elevated, may our lovers and may our helpers not be taken away by evil wings. If you are ready to pray, lift your voice and begin to thank God. Bless his name. Oh, this morning you are going to pray and intercede. Intercession is a gift and a blessing. Come on. Come on. Come on. Come on. Kede ba shatadaba. Iba kadosh. Ze kadabaya. Rabato shakata. Ebandoria kabadabaya. We honor you, Jesus. We bless your name. We give you all the praise. We give you all the glory. We thank you that we have seen today. We thank you that we are in a good shape. We thank you that we can see, we can hear. We thank you that you are with us. We thank you that we find ourselves with a congregation of prayer men and prayer women across the globe joining together on start and start to pray. We thank you that our prayers are heard. We thank you that our prayers are answered. We thank you, we thank you, we thank you, we thank you. We bless your name. Ah, da kaba da brande, kapa ya da kada vala da da shata. Le pa de le ba. Thank God for your helpers. Thank God for your people who pray for you. Thank God for your mothers. Thank God for the fathers. Bless the name of the Lord. Bless him. Bless him. Give him thanks. Give him praise. Kaya de 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 de. Zanda ba ya da kada ba ya. Zekapayada barosata, rekapayada bade brendosha, ayene katada bade daba. We thank you. Share the link. Share the link. Thou prepare the table before me. We thank you for your preparations. In the name of, Jesus. in the mighty name of, Jesus. say my father, my maker. Any manipulation, any manipulation. Demonic, manipulation. demonic manipulation, witchcraft manipulation, and contentions, and contentions. separating me Separate from my helpers, from my helpers. separating me Separate from, my from my lovers. That's when it's time for honor, when it's time for elevation. My helpers are nowhere to celebrate, to be celebrate with me, Father Lord. Let that contention be broken from my life. Let that manipulation be removed from my life. Say, I refuse to lose my loved ones and my helpers to contentions and manipulations in the name of Jesus. Any manipulation aside. To separate me from my helpers, to separate me from my partners, to separate me from those who stand with me. Father Lord, I 
break. I cancel that manipulation and that contention from the pit of hell to separate my helpers, my partners, and I. As I pray, let that contention be removed, be taken away. Lift your voice and pray right now. Is the mighty name of Jesus. My Father, my Maker, we pray right now that any form of manipulation, any form of contention coming in between my helpers and myself, coming in between, uh, Father, my sponsors, my support system, uh, and myself, uh, any form of manipulation, uh, any manipulator, uh, setting confusion uh, between us, uh, in the name of Jesus, uh, let that contention, uh, let that manipulation uh, be cut off now, be cut off now in the name of Jesus when it is time for us to be honored our helpers to be around our those who helped us to be around those who stood with us to be around we will not be honored in the midst of enemies in the name of Jesus yay Brother, we cut them away. We cut them off. No manipulation will take you away from your helpers. No manipulation will take you away from your sponsors. When it is time for honor, they will be honored as well. In the name of Jesus, no manipulation will separate you from your mother, will separate you from your father who labored for you, will separate you from your senior siblings who labored for you. In the name of Jesus, we pray that no contention, no manipulation will separate you from senior colleagues, will separate you from senior members of your community who advised us, who took care of us. No manipulation, no contention will take us out of their lives, will take them out of our lives in the name of Jesus. Kaya Padaba. Manipulation, sir, from the power of darkness, sir. Manipulation, sir, will not separate us. Ayeka Pada Dada Repandele Basua. Mayokotos. In the name of Jesus, it will never happen. It will never happen. Any manipulation to separate them when it's time for you to celebrate, then you are standing in the place of your enemies, strangers all around you. It will not happen. It will not happen. We pray that whatever the enemy is doing to take good people away from you, that your day of celebration will be among strangers. May the Lord deliver you. We cut them off. We cut them off. We cut them off. Are you praying? Hey, in the name of can I suggest to you, listen, child of God, don't let manipulation and contentions cause you to break away from family. You didn't hear this one. You didn't hear this one. It doesn't matter. There is a reason why God put you in that family. Don't let manipulations of the devil and contentions break you away. That on the day of your engagement, it is friends and neighbors you carry to go and marry. Where is your family? Where's your family? Where's your that prepared the table before me in the presence of my enemies. Now, who call warrior? Adam for four. And I want you to call warrior. Who about power here? We push your forward here. I young in to conquer and get it. I'm a bush. say, May the Lord take you away from every form of manipulation Amen. that breaks the home, Amen. that breaks the family. Can I pray and say, Oh Lord, deliver me. My family and my house from manipulations and contentions in the name of Jesus. Put us together for the Lord. By the time we are being graduated, we are graduating from school. 
then it's only friends and family. Hey. Oh. Oh. oh, sad. May that never be our story. Amen. You know what I'm telling you, what I'm preaching here. <laughs> Let's go to the next point, number two. When you are going to marry, and it's time for you to be elevated, it's time for you to be promoted, the strangers are hey. around you. Where is your mother? Where is daddy? Where is your senior siblings? Where are they? They are nowhere to be found, even though they are those who sold. Some of them even sacrificed their time in school for you. Why? Because today, those people are sick. And their sickness will not allow them to be able to be there. Today, we are praying that those who have helped us, may sickness will not take them from our celebration. Do you understand this matter? <laughs> may, may diseases not put them in one place. Amen. That you are supposed to be walked down the aisle. Your father who sacrificed everything for you and the day of your marriage, then your father is stricken with stroke and mm. cannot walk. Mm. And the stranger now has to walk you down the aisle. Yeah. Father, oh. deliver them. Every helper of ours who is sick, yes. people have stood with us, our intercessors, our yes. prayer warriors, our pastors, yes. pastors now, pastors before, yes. pastors then, yes. wherever they are, Father, we pray that may our helpers hey. not be kept in one place with sickness. Yeah. Say in the name of Jesus, in the sickness, in the infirmity that has come up against our helpers that has come up against our family, our loved ones, that they will not or they cannot be present on the day of our elevation and promotion. As we pray, we declare healing right now. Healing into their bodies. Healing into their bodies right now. Pray right now in the name of Jesus. Rabakata. In the name of Jesus, oh God. Any infirmity that has kept people down. Any infirmity that has kept them down. Mercy Lord. Mercy Lord. Mercy Lord. Heal them. Heal them. Heal them. Heal them. May we not celebrate in strange places. May our helpers, our family be with us in the name of Jesus. May sickness not keep them. May contentions not keep them away. Father, we pray that every sickness that would take them from the day of our celebration. Father, let that sickness be healed. Father, heal them in the name. Say, Oh Lord, any strange disease that has come upon my helpers, that has come upon my family, my brothers, my siblings, my friends. Father, Lord, I declare healing. I declare healing. I declare healing over their lives. I declare healing over their lives. Perfect health. Perfect health for our mothers. Perfect health for our fathers. Perfect health for our siblings. Wherever they are stricken with sicknesses and diseases, may they be healed in the name of Jesus. We pray healing into their bodies. Pray healing into their bones. You don't understand what I'm talking about. I remember one day I walked into my senior brother's house I and I think it was his wedding or engagement and my father was unwell. Mm. This is a gentleman, you don't understand. Uh. My father was unwell and could not attend hey. the wedding. Jesus. Do you know what the man did? He needed his father to be there so much that he took the picture and photoshopped his father into the wedding picture. Because he knew it is never complete. When the father is not there. Jesus. Why, why can't you just forgive? Hey. Why can't you just let go of contentions? Father. And now look at you. Look at us. We are in a world surrounded by strangers we don't know. Jesus. He's prepared a table before us in the presence of our enemies. 
customize enemies. Final prayer topic. Premature death. Watch this. People will be walking down the aisle and they will be crying. On their wedding day, pam, pam, pana, here comes the bride and the bride is crying. And people are saying, oh, tears of joy. Oh, tears of joy. It may not be tears of joy. Go and check. Hey. It is the tears that if my father was alive, he would be the one to walk me down this aisle. My God. It is the tears that if my mother was alive, hey. he would be the one organizing this marriage. Hey. It is the tears that if my parents were here, hey. I wouldn't have had this person walking me down the aisle. Hey. Some people have total strangers nominated by family hey. walking them down the aisle. They don't know them. Hey. But why? It's because death took their parents early. My God. Premature death. Yes. There is somebody remaining in your life. They must not die. Hey. They must not die. Yes. They are investing in us. And they will not die. They will not die. But they will live they will to live. see our elevations and our glory. Apostle General will not die. He will live yes. to see his sons. Sons biological. Sons spiritual. Who have grown to be captains of industry. Who have grown to be commanders of nations. Am I talking here? I said your father must not die. Your mother must not die. Hey. Your senior siblings must not die. Hey. They must live hey. to see hey. the goodness of the Lord bestowed hey. upon your family. Hey. Oh, you missed a place to put your hands. Send us fire emojis. Hey. Start a step. Start a step. We are saying, Father Lord, any arrow of premature death targeting those who have stood with me, Father, may they not die until they see me marry. May they not die until they see me have my children. Yeah. You don't understand. There are people yeah. praying for you. There are people praying for you. They must not die until they see that prayer answered. Yeah. We are saying that they are those who, they are the only people who believed in you. Yeah. They are the only people who trusted yeah. that it is possible yeah. for something good to come out of Nazareth. Oh and yet, when it's time for that good thing to come out and it has come out, they are rather dead. Yeah. Say in the name of Jesus. In the name of Jesus. We, pray we pray divine preservation. Divine preservation. Over them, them. our mothers, mothers, our fathers, our our helpers. May they see see the good seed seed they have sown sown in our lives lives. begin to bear fruit. In the name of Jesus, begin to pray right now. Mention their names, your mother, be it your father. Mention their names. We are saying, Father, longevity, preservation. May they be there on the day of your elevation and on the day of your promotion. May they be alive to be partakers. May they not die before their time. Lift your voice and pray. Those who must live to see your great, your grandchildren, they must live. Those who must live to see you finish your building, they must live. Those who must live to see you become a CEO, they must live. Father, long life, preservation. Pray. 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 In the name of Jesus, I pray for my mother. I pray for my mother-in-law. I pray for my senior brother. I pray for my senior sisters. Father, may they live. May they live. Father, may they live. May they live. May they live. I pray for my father, the Apostle General. I pray for my mother, Mama Rita. I pray, I pray, I pray, I pray for all those who contributed, those who brought us this far. Father, Lord, may see their names. Rapaya katada daba, rekada bada daba. We pray, may they see us rise. They know our beginnings. They suffered with us. May they see us rise in my ministry. I pray, I pray. May see their names. May see their names. May they not die. May they live. May they not die. May they live. Masada daba. They will live and not die. They will live. And not die. Every arrow of death fired against them. Every arrow of death fired against their lives. Uh, let that arrow be broken. In the name of Jesus. Say, oh Lord. Oh, Lord. Every, attack Every attack of death, of death against, their life against their life because, because of, their of their help to me. To me. Father, Lord, Father Lord, let that arrow, let that arrow backfire. backfire. 
I didn't hear. Say, let that arrow backfire. Say, oh Lord, any arrow fired against helpers, against lovers, against providers who stood with me because they stood with me as I pray. Let the arrow fired against them backfire. Lift your voice and pray one more minute. They will not die. They will live. They will live. They will live. They will live. They will prosper. They will live. They will prosper. They will live. They will prosper. They will live. In the name of Jesus, we pray that whosoever has helped us before, whosoever has sown a seed into our lives, has sown a seed into our ministry, be you a minister, be you a pastor, whosoever has prayed for you before, may they not die. May they live and see us grow from glory to glory. May they not die. One of the most beautiful experiences on earth is when God blesses you and you meet your class 5, your class 3 teacher. It is a very beautiful experience. When you meet your grade 3, your grade 4 teacher, those who of us used to listen to us from abroad, you meet your teacher from your grade schools, your primary schools, you realize that God has been faithful. Those who invested in you, they have seen their investment grow and now you are standing before them as a woman or as a man. It is enough fulfillment to let them know their lives were not wasted. I pray that those who help us, may they not count their help as waste. May they not die before their time. May they always be present. And may they be remembered at the point of our rising. We pray that may the Lord cause us not to be elevated in the midst of enemies. In Jesus' mighty name, we pray and call it done. Amen and amen. The Lord bless you. The Lord bless you. The Lord bless you. The Lord bless you. Hallelujah. Amen. We are coming your way first of March, and we are, starting, we are starting the month with a communion service. We pray that you shall join us, and you will join us with your communion, your blood elements. You shall join us with your communion, your, um, your wine, or whatever you have present with you as we take to start the month. Your life will never be the same Amen. as a start a stair. Yes. God richly bless you. My name is the Reverend Kalke. Call me the revivalist. Do have a stand up day. I love you, sir. I love you, man. I love you.